Oh, I see. It's, it's home, both places. I really see that. The Western perspective is always so oriented towards here and there. Yes, you made it clear. This is home to you too, right? You know, that's, that's, why, that's, why, that's why generations have a hard time identifying the culture because there's so much exposure nowadays. It's hard to live the culture. It's hard to be disciplined enough to, like with Papa, um, and, and, and the way he was taught, yeah, five, four years old. But now there's so much, so much avenues that you gotta go to just to survive in this part of the world that it's hard, hard, hard for, 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 for students to do that, yeah? And to live the culture. Learning navigation is not going on every night. And just watching stars and jumping on a canoe every couple of days and feeling the ocean. You live it every single day. And with that, along with navigation comes everything else. Because you're learning all the elements and how to utilize elements, plants and everything. So with Papa, he's not... He's a navigator, grandmaster navigator, but he's, he's also he's also very very knowledgeable in la la pa, very very knowledgeable in planting. How to use the moon and everything for planting, for fishing, for building things, survival. But they, but because you, they live the culture. They live it every day. Whereas us, we live it a little while. We jump in the car, we go KTA buy something for drink or go on 7-Eleven. These guys, you go to the island no more now. The 7-Eleven is a coconut tree. It's a <clears throat> Did you make your own sanity? Mm -hmm. yeah. Senate is uh, every year they make sanity. Here, because Senate is like gold in Hawaii, right? Well, because plenty Senate in, in a store. <laughs> they want to buy. By the time, no more store, they make the Senate every day because they use for the tennis, use for the house. Do you see your island becoming more, um, with more conveniences? More what? Uh, more modern things. More modern things. Are there, are there more mod modern things coming to your island that make No. So no electricity? No. They use, the light is, they use the lamp. Carcine lamp. They use the coconut oil before, no time ago. They burn the coconut oil in the land? Oh no, kerosene. They, they boil the, the coconut uh, milk. They come all of them. They use that for uh, light. And cooking is all? Cooking is the fire. They make fire. No stores, no. But this time they use stores. Before, no more stuff. They used to fire. This time it's they used to fire. You must be the most well-traveled person on your island. <laughs> huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we, we, we can have break with we need to whip it. Huh? The goal is to speak for stopping. Then, halfway through World Indigenous People program, at, um, the, the, the World Indigenous People program on education, Mao comes in. So we get back Sunday from uh, Kilo. And Monday we start the, uh, we're doing uh, the, the, the Micronesian voyage to move. So it's boom, 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 boom. And in the process of doing that, we're talking about building this canoe for Micronesian. That's a good thing to do. Thank you for all that you, you've done, even for people that you don't even know, like people like me and I, I'm not, 
you know, I'm not a canoe person or anything, yeah. but you really enriched my life. I mean, everyone, everyone's life. A lot of you made it. Now you know the reason why we do it. Yes. And yes. I don't think people say, well, how come you, you know, she's busy with me, Charlie, Charlie, and something. You're so dedicated to this man. You have to sit on the top there. Yeah, I know. And then also ask him, what is it? Why are you guys, especially me, why am I so adamant about culture? But, you know, when you go to the island like where he's from, and you go home to settle, you didn't know what, you know, and you still need that. Still separate it back. Language is back. The culture, system, spiritual system, the same thing. And you know the best thing about it? They can survive without anybody being there. Wow. They don't need the rest of the world. They're self-sufficient. One of the most awesome things for us was us being able to sit in the, in, in the canoe, the men's house in Sarawak. And uh, after being told stories about home, for so many years, and then to be able to sit there, and to be able to sleep there, and, and, and allow to dream, and feel a presence, you know. That's awesome. When you go back and you be teaching? No, in my island. On your island? Yeah. But I don't know, somebody might put me in one of them. Each everybody is important. I don't know when I go home, I don't know. See that what they do. You must know everyone on the island. Oh, yeah. uh -huh. mm -hmm. The time to go much easier. Go to important place. First time the people in important place, they know that too. Because before nobody do that. That's what see, they see the church, they, they think, oh, maybe. We grab him, stay here. <laughs> Never go to him. I <laughs> they want him. Hey, hey, hey. I go home first then. You guys thinking about me. Now I like go home. Then send the people in two. My family in two is they say, can you stay here? Oh, maybe I go home first. And like me. Are teaching him too. That's why when I come back from Saipan, the chief in my island, they told me, you never go somewhere. You stay there. Start teaching that young man. But when I was there, before the church, to my community, every Friday I teach a young man in my So it's mostly men, the males, who learn that. You want the women too? Women too?